It's 6.37 in the morning here. A lot of times I get up and that's when I do my best thinking, get my cup of coffee. And I was sitting here this morning thinking of her, uh, some of the crazy things I've done throughout my lifetime. And I've done quite a bit. This, this one in particular has come back to haunt me many, many times. It was uh, early 70s. I was in college at the time, and it was between semester breaks in the summer. I got a job at a company working in the engineering department. I did think it was kind of odd because I had to sign a waiver, you know, of secrecy that I would not discuss, you know, what I was working on. I mean, we're talking engineering here. What's the big deal? But anyway, I had to sign this document that, you know, I would never talk about it and so forth and so on. So... I was hired by the company, and we were each given a piece of this job that we were working on, and we were not allowed to discuss it with each other. We went in, we did our job, and basically that was it. It was a systems company, and I was not really, at that time, concerned about, you know, I did my job, I did it, you know, very well, and they were very pleased, and at the end of the summer, of course, I moved on back to college and so forth. Anyway, I had a lot going on in my life at that time. You know. Years later, I found out the project that we were working on was a scanner that everyone uses with the barcode on the product. And every time I go to a grocery store and they scan it and it comes up wrong, I sit there and think, should I have... Uh, sabotaged it or but just interesting things that you do throughout your life that you were you know not even really aware of and uh, now as I sit here today uh, the owner of that company I don't even know if he is still alive or or whatever he was brilliant he really was brilliant and the engineers that, was, that were working with him let's face it it was it was computer generated um, and I'm saying it was early 70s, uh, maybe 74, 75, something like that. Uh, might have even been 73. I don't know. But anyway, uh, I'm, I'm leaning more towards 74, 75. But, uh, yeah, uh, the scanner, scanner system that we all use today, um, you walk into a Walmart, you pick up an item, you go over to their scanner, scan the barcode, it tells you how much it is. The system is a, a good system, but like with everything else, back when it originally came out, you didn't have to worry about it. When they scanned a project, a product, um, it came up with the correct price because those prices have to be entered into the computer by someone. And if the price is entered wrong, of course, you're going to get a wrong price. Um, but it is a much quicker system. Uh, <coughs> it's more of a sure system. <coughs> no one can enter uh, a, a wrong price or, or something of that nature. And also for all your inventory, um, it, was, it really was a, a quite a project. And, and to this day, it has been a, a large savings for companies and so forth. So I guess I could actually say I was pretty proud pretty proud to be part of a, a project such as that. It's just, you know, one of those things that um, I did. Did it good. Walked away. Years later found out. There it is. Just putting that out there. And it, you know, something I was thinking about. Anyway, have a good day. Uh, beautiful here in Pennsylvania. I mean, it's an absolutely gorgeous morning. Nice and cool. We'll see what the day brings. Catch you guys later.